then let's go live now then come on let's go live right hello and welcome back to the man united fan stand it is your team news video for manchester united versus everton so right the team news is in uh, i mean am i happy with this team but before i start you know talking about it then uh, i'll read out to you first so in goal you we've got david de gea defense young smalling lindelof and shaw uh then you got center midfielders fred matic and pogba up front we got Mata, Rafa, the Martial. I mean, look, 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 to be honest with you, the side's all right in my opinion. It's not the best. I mean, look, the things which have let me down is that you're playing bloody sure it right back. That's not where he plays. He's meant to be a left back. I mean, look, we saw how good actually Young can play at right back. So play him where he can play. Luke Shaw's going to left back, so play him where he can play. And then you've got Smalling and Bloody Lindelof working together. Look, our defence, it is messed up. It isn't good. And it's wrong. The defence is all wrong. Mourinho's got them all in the wrong position. So, um, well, he hasn't got Smalling and Lindelof in the wrong position. But the thing is for them is that they, they're two players who can't be playing. So, look, Jose Mourinho has totally, totally messed them up. Um, and then you've got... Um, and then you've literally got uh, Fred, Matic and Pogba. Look, for me, um, if you look at Fred... Uh, uh, look, um, yeah, Fred's playing. Um, I'm happy about that. I think that we do need Fred's talent in the sides. And then we got Manny and Matic. Dirty player recently, to be honest with you. Uh, the Manny and Matic, he hasn't been on his best form. Uh, he is a player who really does need to go on and improve. But look, for me... And then you've got Paul Pogba as well. I'm, 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 I'm happy about Paul Pogba. And then you've got Matter on a bloody wing. Um, right, so Matter's on the left. Look, Matter's a bloody... He he's a centre striker. He doesn't work in well in this position where we. I mean, in this formation, he doesn't work well in the position that we're playing him in either. So disappointing. I I, I don't know what Mourinho is thinking with uh, one matter. You know, you're playing Rafa up front, and you've got Martial on the right. Uh, Lukaku's been dropped. I've been saying it. Drop Lukaku. Drop Lukaku. That is what you have to do. Give him a rest, and then you can play next game. Bring him on as a sub. You, you never know. If we bring Lukaku on as, as a sub, give him a rest. Because for me, from what we've saw so far this season, Lukaku isn't a player who is capable enough of, you know, starting a game. And he's, he's not capable enough of playing a full 90 minutes on the field. So we got Alexis Sanchez on the bench. I wouldn't expect him to really travel the team, to be honest. But he, he's there. Uh, yeah, but look, Sanchez right now is a bench player for Manchester United, and I agree. Sanchez is a bench. He he's a bench player. Don't play him. Uh, and then we've got Jesse Lingard on right at right mid. Um, I mean, no, on, on the bench. Sorry, not right mid. He he's a right midfielder though. But could you could you stick him in there instead of one matter? That's the thing. So what you could do, what Mourinho could do, you play Rashford up front. That's fine. I mean, I, I'm happy with playing Rashford up front. Uh, I don't have a problem with that whatsoever. Martial's good on the right. Uh, but what you could do, take out one matter, change Martial to the left, and then you can put uh, Lingard on the right. But will Lingard deliver after he's he's, he's been injured for a while? So so will he deliver? Uh, Marcus Rock. Uh, um, wait, Marcus Rocco has made it to the bench. I mean, look, you could play him at centre back. You could play him. Uh, Bailey hasn't made it to the bench. Uh, and Herrera's on the bench. Uh, that's a good one. I mean, I just want Pereira for Matic. Um, and then you got Romero on the bench. That's fine. And you got Darmian as well. I mean, look, Darmian, he, he's not going to come on in the game. But look, for me, it's. I'm I'm kind of I'm I'm kind of happy with it. There there are problems in this in this side though. There are real problems and we do have to work on them. But the thing is, 
So if you look at so uh, 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 the formations, there's the usual formation, yeah, which is a four three three. I mean, look, I'm I'm starting to get bored of this formation, even though we haven't played it in a lot in our last two games. But look, I mean, it's not uh, it's it's not good enough really to you know look. This can't be our set formation. It is our set formation, but. Why can't we just play a different formation though? That is what I say. Play a bloody different formation. That that's what we got to do. Because look, the thing is, is that look, this formation's getting boring. Uh, Everton, are, you know, they probably look, the players and stuff. They probably watched us a few times. They know what we're going to do. When we play this formation, it's expected what we're going to do. They're going to literally re revive the moves or, like, the tactics which we are doing. Because it's the exact same tactics, ev like, in the, in this formation. It, and, you know, I, I, I'm not saying change the formation every game, but these are easy tactics that we have got right now, though. No need playing the formation. Everton can easily get around us. I mean, look at our defence. You've got Smalling and Lindelof in there. They're probably going to mess it up. Sure, terrible against Juventus. And then we've got Ashley Young, who always goes out, plays his heart out, which is good. But look, Ashley Young's the guy, carries the defence. That is what a captain does. But for me, give Paul Pogba the captain's armband. He's more of a captain than Ashley Young. He's more of a team leader. He's more of, you know... What Paul Popper does, he, he supports the team a bit more, though, to be honest with you, in my opinion. But, look, I'm I'm not overly happy with it. I, I, I'm not annoyed. I'm not ranting about the team because there's no need to rant. It's not... Look, it's no, there's no need to rant about this team because, for me, th there are problems in it, though. But I'm, I'm, I'm not ranting. But... No, we, we, we do have to be careful, though. We, we are missing out on Lukaku. Who the hell cares about we're missing out on Lukaku? Lukaku is useless. Yes, we're playing Everton. It, I mean, I've said it a few times. It's probably the game where he will probably shy out. Uh, I, I mean, shine, to be honest. Not shy out, shine. He'll, he'll probably be really good in this game. I mean, it's like every player. They usually put on quite a good performance against their former side. So, maybe... That's what the Kaku could do. So you never know. We could actually be missing out on the Kaku's talent. But first of all, Rashford's faster than the Kaku. So yeah, uh, Martial's faster. But you know, but you never know what one matter can do. But one matters. Um, you know, he's more. He's a player who whips them in. He's not like a player who's capable enough to really cross them into the box. That's not really one matter. He he he's not a player. That is meant to do that. He, he 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 whips them in, helps out the striker, or he's in the box. He tries to get his head on it. He he he's no he's no winger. So I that's the thing that I don't understand. Why play him at the wing where when he can't play there? But the thing is, is that that's Mourinho for you. He's going to play players out of position though, and that's exactly what one matter's doing. He's out of position. Uh, and the, the, the thing is, one matter has, I mean, look, one matter never puts on a good performance there. That's why he always gets dropped from the team. Because Mourinho plays in there, he's he, he's going to get dropped again because he's not going to have a good performance there today. So he is get, going to get dropped. So we have to have faith in this team. Um, yeah, so my score prediction is 2-1 to Manchester United. Uh, I think my... Uh, I, I'm going to say Rashford to score one. And I'm going to say Martial to score one. I mean, yeah, you know, hopefully Matter puts on a good performance. So my key player, the player that I am looking out for today is Rashford. Look, we have to support Rashford and, you know, look, we just have to see what he can really do up front if he can bring the goods, if he is better than Lukaku. Because the thing with Lukaku, we can't score goals with him. With Rashford, it might change. We need a striker who can actually go on and score goals. So, and hopefully Rashford is one of those players who can go on and score the goals. So... Yes, uh, just saying that there will be a lot, uh, there will be a watch along on the United 2's channel, so uh, that is my brother's channel, so go go over there to the United 2 and we will be starting uh, quite, we will be starting shortly on that, so anyway, I will speak, I'll speak to you all uh, for the aftermatch reaction on this channel, so yeah, uh, I'll see, I'll, I'll speak to you all at about 6 o'clock, that is when my match reaction will be out, so speak to you all at 6 o'clock, it will be a stream, so yeah, thanks for watching.
Come on, United.